The shooter is an invisible gravity connection designed to eliminate the need for aesthetically undesirable corbels, haunches, or daps when building a precast pre-stressed concrete structure incorporating double T's. More specifically, it is a tube within a tube which is cast into the ends of the double T stems at their widest point. The inner tube is recessed during casting and extended at erection into a receiving pocket in a spandrel, wall, or beam. To prevent the inner tube from recessing back into the double T, a pin is installed through the projected inner tube after the double T is set in its final position. The shooter connection system is simple, efficient connection that creates clean, elegant lines. Beyond aesthetics and benefits are, it eliminates weld on corbels and ledges, reduces torsion on supporting members, reduces the size of the pocket and the spandrel, eliminates dap forming, bearing plate, and reinforcing, simplifies erection, does not require diving of double T's into pockets, allows for axial volume movements due to creep, shrinkage, and temperature change, can increase ceiling height or reduce overall height of the structure, and full-scale tested solution to verify design methodology. Full-scale test results have indicated that the shooter has a mechanical design strength in excess of 40,000 pounds. The testing also indicated that a strut and tie model can be used to design any member using the shooter as a connection. To achieve the mechanical design capacity of the shooter, sufficient concrete must surround the shooter to develop the required compression strut capacity and reinforcing must be supplied to develop the required tension strut capacity. At the time of casting, the inner tube is recessed fully inside of the other tube. This creates a condition where no additional formwork is required. A rebar cage is required to be installed around the shooter. The cage can be designed for any section assuming a strut and tie method. The design methodology has been tested and complete design information can be found in our published shooter technical data. The shooter is anchored to the form using a rubber mandrel bolted to the bulkhead. To further prevent rotation, the back end of the shooter is tied to a U-shaped rebar. To prevent concrete from getting inside of the inner tube, the open end should be sealed by using tape or a similar tool. When the shooter arrives at the site, the inner tube is still fully recessed inside of the outer tube and flush with the end of the double T. This allows the double T to be moved into position without requiring an elevation change between the ends of the double T. The double T is lowered to the correct position. The wires are then used to extract the inner tube from the outer tube into a receiving pocket in the supporting element. Once the tubes have been extracted, an erection pin is installed to prevent the inner tube from retracting back into the outer tube. The receiving pocket is intentionally oversized to allow the installation of the erection pin. At JVI, it is our mission to be on the cutting edge of new connections to further the advancement of our industry. Please consider utilizing the inherent advantages of the shooter in your next parking garage.